The road to Omaha goes through North Carolina. Eight teams in the NCAA tournament, including the number one overall seed. So winning it all is the ultimate feeling, but getting in is the first step. The world might not know these guys now, but they will. We're a bunch of, of, of nobodies from nowhere, man. Nobody knows who, who we are. Nobody knows, you know, maybe the names that, that are on the back of our jersey, and, and, and that's okay. Campbell, two seed for the first time in program history. Of course, their resume was good enough to host. Yes, would they have liked to host? Absolutely. Do they feel like they did enough? Absolutely. Do they care when it comes to Friday night? Absolutely not. The Camels draw NC State, who was anxiously waiting on the bubble. It's been a probably a nervous four days. If you talk to my wife, she must be close to an angel. After missing the tournament last year and having 2021's College World Series run cut off by COVID protocols, Elliot Avent and the team won't take this one for granted. I told players it never gets old to go. I don't care how many times you've been. I don't care how old you are going is what it, this is all about. Yeah! UNC baseball, a two seed in the Indiana State Regional. They'll play Iowa fresh off a trip to the ACC championship. This is why you do it. That's what I told our guys. Like, this is what you've been waiting for. No offense to the ACC tournament. People rem remember you based on what you do this time of year. And here's the rest of the North Carolina teams. Wake Forest, the number one overall seed, hosting George Mason in the Winston-Salem Regional. Charlotte, the three seed in the Clemson Regional. They play Tennessee. ECU gets an at-large, but after getting upset by Tulane in the American Championship, they play Oklahoma in Charlottesville. And Duke, the two seed in the Coastal Carolina Regional, they play UNC Wilmington. Regionals run June 2nd through the 5th. Early evening baseball at the D-Bat Bowls, barbecuing the Jacksonville Shrimp. Kyle Manzardo had the smoker, the air fryer, charcoal, and the flat iron grill, grill going. Four of six for him, two RBI as the Bulls get the win, 13 to two. And the Coca-Cola 600 postponed Sunday, so this was the last thing you wanted to see. More umbrellas, 600 miles, felt like 600 weather delays and restarts. But once they got it going, it was a heck of a race. Each driver racing to remember a veteran on Memorial Day. We go to lap 185. Two of the biggest names in the sport going at it here. Denny Hamlin puts Chase Elliott into the wall. Elliott said after the race, once you hit the wall, it's over in these cars. He made sure it was for both of them. Hamlin said Elliott should be suspended after the race. Super speedways, as we know all about restarts. 26 to go. Ryan Blaney overtakes William Byron before Kyle Larson gets in the big one here. And Blaney would hang on from there, snapping a 59 race winless streak. And Duke lacrosse falling down early to Notre Dame in the national championship game. Valiant comeback, but it wasn't enough as Notre Dame wins the national championship 13 to 9. So we finished the hockey season right into lacrosse, and we got a lot of baseball coming up. Never 